Welcome back to Best Buddy Gaming. Today, Angel Citadel. I'm gonna do another uh, two-unit loadout here. Same, same exact cat combos. We'll have the research up and the uh, the dual massive damage. So today, we're gonna use Ramen as the meat shield. And I mean, to be honest, I think Ramen can carry probably most of this by himself. I'd actually be surprised if he could solo the whole thing. But I think towards the end, we need the little bit of distance from Mushroom. So, and Mushroom has the I think it's area attack as well. Uh, so let's just see. Yeah, I think this is pretty much gonna be an absolute beatdown from the Angel perspective. I debated, uh, because I got Momotaro, I debated true forming it and um, using ramen and then, what is it, Peach Devils or whatever? Uh, but, I mean, obviously an Uber is gonna help significantly, but I figured Mushroom would be fun to use. One of the, uh, you know, the ancient eggs and uh, see what we can do with him. So, so far, floor two. The only problem here is ramen moves so slow. Even with the speed up on it, it's like, my goodness. But Mushroom actually comes out pretty quick, so I figure get kind of like a little stack of ramen in front and then Mushroom can catch up fairly quick like you can see here. It's actually pretty easy and he is, he's never gonna make it down there. So I'd be curious, that was what, two? Two Relic Doges in a row there? Uh, this, I bet you we're gonna get one of those gross looking worm things. I feel like those are in everything in the beginning of the uh, first few floors of the towers. I mean, uh, Citadels. Uh, all right, so let's see. Yeah, so this one, get going. I gotta say that that boost of cat combos is probably one of the best ones. Obviously, as long as you get a massive, uh, massive against uh, traded unit in there. But yeah, the research up and then a dual massive is pretty sweet. I wonder if there's that was ridiculous. I wonder if there's um, any research combos for masses up, ma massive up that is a one one slot. That would be nice. I, I don't have it. I know I know there isn't one that I have. Uh, and I actually, I think all the ones I have are all small. It would be nice to get maybe at least a medium. You know what's weird too? There's a couple of small ones that are three slots. And it's like, why the heck would I ever use that? Uh, I mean, I get it. Some people might get access to it earlier, but yeah, definitely, definitely go for the dual massives. All right, so that was, that was easy. So the angel worm was there. I don't even know if we gave anything time to come out in floor three besides that doge. Uh, all right, so let's see. Get the, oh, this is a short one. So I bet you... But floor five, so we might have something possibly. Oh, a little bit of traitless. And let's see, what do we got? Oh, the big old angel, uh, right. What is it, hippo? Angel hippo? I don't know what they call that one. All right, that was easy. It is kind of, it is funny. I, I don't think the, I think the red one is all entirely, and same thing with the black citadel, all entirely that color, but obviously angel, traitless, obviously, but uh, yeah, they throw in some, some traitless, a little. A little interesting. Actually, I think there is some traitless in the black one. I can't remember. Uh, all right, so let's see. Floor six. We're gonna start getting a little bit difficult now. Uh, let's see. I know it's not yet, but I know there is a sleepner on some stages. Oh, okay, so we got the annoying gories. Look at that. Ramen. Ramen doesn't care. He's like, yeah, whatever. I'm just gonna keep pounding away here. And boom, that's done. Beautiful, beautiful. So I gotta check. Uh, I'm trying to think. Yeah, I think that the next, when that Relic Citadel comes out, it'll be the next update. So it's definitely not coming out this pass of Citadels, which, which definitely stinks. But I'll go through all the other Citadels again and try and uh, two unit these. But like I said, Ural is going to be fun for the Aku one. Uh, and then I'm going to get back into some more Uncanny Legends. And we'll see what happens from there. Uh, I don't know. I think, I thought I read somewhere that people are saying rumored 13-1 will be sometime in February. So that would be nice. Um, I just want the Metal Slug collab, to be honest with you. Uh, oh, this thing's annoying. All right, so that's, uh, let's see. Ramen did not care at all about that. Okay. That was absolute piece of cake. Ah, uh, so these things slow. That's annoying. And there's Mushroom doing his thing. There we go. Beautiful. Mushroom's pretty clutch. I, I didn't realize how much, uh, how far back he is. I, I thought he was a, a, an up-close unit. All right, so floor eight. So we gotta be, we gotta be doing something decent here. Let's, this, I think this is the sleepner one. I think, is it... The Sleepner with uh, Sunfish Jones, that might be the next stage. But I think this one's going to be a little bit tougher. I'm sure there's going to be a, a grindy one. I do know, I think it's the last stage that has the Octopus things. Those things are super annoying. Because especially if you get some meat shields in there for them, they uh, they just keep backline sniping you. It's very, very frustrating. All right, so let's see. Cool down for ramen. Oh, yeah. Okay, so this... Actually, Sleepner's just the boss. This should be easy. Uh, okay, let's see. Mushroom's cooldown is pretty darn quick, too. I think it's actually a little faster than Hitman. That's pretty nice. And he's cheaper. Uh, so you can't go wrong there. Oh, dual sleepers, huh? 
All right, so this, oh, yeah, that's all she wrote. You're done, you're done. Didn't even get a chance to resync uh, re yourself. That was awesome. All right, so this one is the Sunfish Jones one, Jones one, because I know the last one is with the, the octopus or whatever the heck you call those things. But this is actually, this is a pretty fun Citadel. And honestly, if you don't have like a boosted ramen, if you have Jizzo, he can, he's, get another meat shield for Jizzo and you could replace Mushroom with that. Uh, anything, as long as, as long as you can uh, stall these guys and have a backliner, you're, you're okay. Um, you know, some of these guys, obviously you get the, the Miss Angel, whatever they are, they're doing the weaken. Uh, so something that you can stack up so you're, if you guys get weakened, they don't get completely shredded. Uh, but let's see. You know, and I think honestly, at least for this Citadel, you could probably even throw Fiend in here. I think she'd be fine, get some knockback. Um, Juliet probably would be a waste. I mean, her freeze, I, don't, I never liked Juliet, to be perfectly honest with you. Um, Sanzo, I, I don't really, I don't think there's a need for Sanzo. Uh, let's see, who else? Um, I'm trying to think off the top of my head for Angel. I can't remember anybody else. You know what it is? Anything with Angel, I always just throw ramen in. And now that I have Mushroom, it's like the, these two. And I, honestly, I do use Fiend a lot for Angel, just because I, I like the knockback and she's got the distance. Um, uh, meat shielding with ramen, you could pretty much have anything back there and you gotta do some damage, so it's really not that bad. So, this is just a grindy nuisance, because these Miss Angels are just weakening my, uh, my ramen. But, okay, there we go. So now that that's gone, once we take out those guys, then we just destroy the Sunfish Jones, and really, this is, this is nothing. Yeah, just super grindy, my god. Just keep stacking them up, though. It's really, it's really not that bad. Oh, we're actually getting back there. There we go. Sunfish is gone. All right, this is this is definitely over. So who was doing the slow? Was the chick bulls doing the slow, right? Or the freeze, whatever? This is done. Okay, beautiful. All right, on to the last one. So that's... Oh, you know what I think there is, too? I think there's a... Uh, Borferum? Sephirum? Borferum? The, the, uh, the angelic boar. I think that's the other piece with the, the octopus. And I don't know if there's actually a sleepener in this one, too. But I, I know, yes, the boar is in this with the octopus. That's super annoying. But these guys are, these guys are nothing. This is just a, a decent source of cash, I guess. Let's see. Not even. Did we get money for that? Let's just, uh, eh. Eh, the doges. Yeah, there we go. Okay, so that's getting some cash there. Uh, our bank is pretty good. I mean, thankfully, these guys are pretty cheap. Even though ramen uh, cools down really quick, if, as long as you got a couple grand in your bank, you're not going to run out of money. Um, oh, I mean, I guess I should say that if... Oh! Yeah, the gory sneaking in there, too. That's not nice. All right, so what the heck... What is that thing called, those octopus? I always forget. But this isn't too bad. As long as we take the gory out... I feel like the gory is more of a nuisance than the, uh, the boar, to be honest with you. They both attack fast, but for some reason, the gory just... I don't know. That obnoxious pushing power is just something that I, I absolutely cannot stand. You know what would be nice is if... Because I feel like a lot of these guys are doing the slow. If uh, Mushroom had resist slow, that would be sweet. I still wish they'd give these egg guys some talents. That would be... I feel like that would be a, a very useful useful thing to get. But we are we are shredding pretty good here. So let's just freeze that. Oh, I thought we took him out. Okay, good. The gory's gone. Oh, no. Two boars. That's, that's not good. Um... But, I mean, look at, jeez, my, my ramen is, I think, 1, 108 now, 110. So he, I mean, he's gonna tank. He's gonna tank a lot. Oh, no, another boy, uh, gory. Oh, two more gories. Oh, this is not good. Uh, might have a problem here. Uh, okay, good. One of the boars is gone. Now we should be, okay, I think I took out another gory there. So there's only one in there. Uh, all right, so really, we take out, we take out that other boar. I think we're in good shape, because that gory, so wait a minute. Why didn't... Okay, never mind, never mind. What, what am I, what am I looking at here? All right, that gory is gone. Another one just came out. Take out this boar and, oh, jeez, we're getting a little close. Uh, ah, oh, come on. There's no way this, this is going to be a loss, though. I, I can't see, I can't see this being a problem here. The uh, stack of mushrooms there is doing some serious damage. Uh, they just got wiped out, but they, oh, good, the gory's gone there. So we take out the boar, then this is just over, but these stupid slug worm things are just piling up here. We got, what, one, two, three, four, five, I think? Can't really count while I'm trying to do this. Uh, oh, boar's gone. This is this is over. Okay. Oof. Man, that was that was ridiculous. All right, take out these worms, and then I think we'll just crush these. Okay. Oh, beautiful. Done. All right. Ramen just seriously uh, headbanging these guys away. Take them out. And oh man, one left. You're done. Oh, beautiful. Wow. What a. Uh, you know, if you don't have if you don't have the right guys, this is definitely a tough citadel. But with with uh, buffed up uh, ramen. You're all set. So join us next time for some more Battle Cats. See you soon.